This is the intercessory prayer moment of the show where right now you can bring your request, your desires, your needs to the altar, to the Father's throne where he will acknowledge them. Right now, this is a moment where we can come to God with our secrets, with our hopes. Would you do so with me? And let's go to the Father's throne. For the listener right now, take 30 seconds to speak to the Master. I will extol the Lord at all times. His praise will always be on my lips. I will glorify the Lord. Let the afflicted hear and rejoice. Glorify the Lord with me. Let us extol his name together. I sought the Lord and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Those who look to him are radiant. Their faces are never covered with shame. This poor man called and the Lord heard him. He saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and he delivers them. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the one who takes refuge in him. Fear the Lord, you, his holy people. Those who fear him lack nothing. The lions may grow weak and hungry, but those who seek the Lord lack no good thing. Come, my children, listen to me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord. Whoever of you loves life and desires to see many good days, Keep your tongue from evil and your lips from telling lies. Turn from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are on the righteous and his ears are attentive to their cry. But the face of the Lord is against those who do evil to blot out their name from the earth. The righteous cry out and the Lord hears them. He delivers them from all their troubles. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. The righteous person may have many troubles, but the Lord delivers him from all of them. He protects all his bones. No one of them will be broken. Evil will slay the wicked. The foes of the righteous will be condemned. The Lord will rescue his servants. No one who takes refuge in him will be condemned. Dear Lord, this is an opportunity to usher us into a reality where we can hear your voice. I'm asking you right now, Holy Spirit, to usher us into the place, to the footstool of grace. Give us a moment, Lord. Give us a miracle right now where each and every individual who hears this prayer feels God wrapped around them. Lord, each and every one of us has been dealt with a tragedy, a heartbreak, a frustration, a perspective. Each person has been told lies and misconceptions of truth that has stopped us. Stopped the very nature of us to continue to push forward. God, you are the only one who turns confusion into clarity. So I'm asking for clarity right now for somebody. If someone feels like they have been forgotten, remind each individual that you are standing and with them right now in their situation. 
the enemy seeks to grab us to destroy all that you're doing lord put a barrier a hedge of protection some of us are stuck and we don't know what to do give us guidance give us a way out give us a breath of fresh air give us a new beginning or the strength to continue forgive us of things we've done against you remind everyone in each individual that there's no place they can go where they're too far from your saving grace i ask for miracles financially academically spiritually physically emotionally for each person right now and seeking for one lord forgive me for my ignorance and arrogance if there is a special prayer a, a secret desire lord grant it if it is according to your will lord i'm asking that you reassure them of your faithfulness of your kindness of how much you love them we love you and we thank you may your name be praised both now and forevermore from the rising of the sun to the place where it sets in jesus name amen